The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier, and our first reading is taken from the first letter of St. Peter. I urge the elders among you as a fellow elder myself and a witness to the sufferings of Christ, and as one who is to have a share in the glory that is to be revealed. Give a shepherd's care to the flock of God that is entrusted to you. Watch over it, not simply as a duty, but gladly as God wants. Not for sordid money, but because you are eager to do it. Do not lord it over the group which is in your charge, but be an example for the flock. When the chief shepherd appears, you will be given the unfading crown of glory. And our response is taken from Psalm 23. Yahweh is my shepherd. I lack nothing. In grassy meadows, he lets me lie. By tranquil streams, he leads me to restore my spirit. He guides me in paths of saving justice as befits his name. Even were I to walk in a ravine as dark as death, I should fear no danger. For you are at my side. Your staff and your crook are there to soothe me. You prepare a table for me under the eyes of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup brims over. Kindness and faithful love pursue me every day of my life. I make my home in the house of Yahweh for all time to come. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. When Jesus came to the region of Caesarea Philippi, he put this question to his disciples. Who do people say the Son of Man is? And they said, some say John the Baptist, some Elijah, and others Jeremiah, or one of the prophets. But you, he said, who do you say I am? Then Simon Peter spoke up and said, you are the Christ, the Son of the living God. God. Jesus replied, Simon, son of Jonah, you are a blessed man, because it was no human agency that revealed this to you, but my Father in heaven. So now I say to you, you are Peter, and on this rock I will build my church, and the gates of the underworld can never overpower it. I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven, Whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven. Whatever you loose on earth will be loosed in heaven. The Gospel of the Lord.